guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes one and two to skip and loafer. So I know nothing about the show. Um, I know this is one of the other shows that you know between last week and the first week this aired, a lot of people wanted me to watch this. So I will also say this: this will be the last show that I will be reacting to for this season because I am hella busy. And I don't want it to be too busy where I get overwhelmed and I feel like I'm burning out and such. And we've I've had those issues in the past with some of the things where like, yes, I want to react to something and then I end up possibly dropping it for some weird reason and people get pissed at me and they're like, well, why are you dropping this? And, da -da -da -da. and I'm like, the big word I say is burnout. Like I'm doing too fucking much. So, yes, but I am excited to see how this is and how it goes. Um, I just know um, specifically the opening got me and because I saw it on TikTok everywhere and I was just like, oh, that's so freaking cute. So, yeah, but other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode one in three, two, one, go. Watch her get lost on the way to school. <laughs> I mean, it makes the most sense for her to be lost because of the fact is, okay, hey, you're from a small little town. You've never been in the city, so, mmm. Oh, oh. <laughs> she better wear that in the show. I'm not the problem if she doesn't. No. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Of course that's cool. I know them feelings, God, like having to get up at six in the morning. 
<sighs> Sometimes I get up at six in the morning and I just don't realize it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but watch. Like, you're gonna get lost. <laughs> the fact that she's also played by What's Her Face from Idol Master, aka Media, and um, My Baby Swindler. <laughs> Oh. Damn, she got it all played out. So does she make it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> My baby. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, honey. Oh. Oh no. No, it wasn't. But I had a feeling you were gonna get lost. Uh, it's Persona Five all over again when you're trying to look in a certain train station. I'm like, oh shit. God. Yeah. Ooh, baby, you awkward, but it's okay. <laughs> well, uh, um, uh huh. Oh my god. <laughs> Huh? I feel like I'm trying to stay awake. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Poor baby, it's okay! You probably are. I mean, besides, it's your first day. You were bound to get lost. It happens. No one's perfect. Come on. It's 
till we make it there in like five minutes. <laughs> it's okay, you can apologize later. <laughs> Please hurry after her so she doesn't pass, like, anything. She's gonna come. She's gonna... <laughs> <sighs> Poor baby. She is just like. <laughs> Oh no. Oh. Do you know it by heart? You gotta do it sometimes. If he wasn't in love with her, then he is in love with her now. That's so freaking cute. <laughs> The pride in her eyes, oh my god. <laughs> That's talent, man. <laughs> Well, now you're going to be known as 
That too. The puker and good speech. Huh. <sighs> Hmm? Damn. That is like a shot you down. If only you hurled somewhere else, like in the bathroom. Oh, did a baby chick, baby chick in the mommy. <laughs> I don't know how all I talk here, Phil, but you people like it. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> Yeah, we just don't want to be known as the barf girl. Yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, a guy. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh, that looks so good. Damn, it's a big ass radishes. The fact that her siblings are over here, like, yeah, we got, she got. 
my life. She'll be okay, though. Isn't that just gone? It did. Let me see. Emergency, mom. Yes, it was with the girl. The What's up? Ah, it is. <laughs> Baby, you're not going to get much sleep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's going to be morning, and then she has to hurry up and get up and get dressed. Oh, baby. Honey, honey, bunny. Mitsu, honey. I, that's why we need sleep. You need enough sleep and such. This is why, like, immediately when I come home from work, I try to get everything done quick, fast, in a hurry. So that, because 50 out of 50, by the time I come home, I when I'm, like, done recording, I kind of took a nap because I am tired after dealing with people for, like, four to five hours and I'm in my day and talking and just be like hi how are you oh my god thank you for coming please come again do you want this overnighted do you want this tomorrow do you want that it's so much things for me to do you want to hear by thursday da -da 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 -da. it's this much da -da 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 -da. <laughs> but she's cute like she's really adorable she just gives me um Because it is her, the person who's voicing her, uh, once again, swindler and media vibes, like, straight up, like, oof, big oof. Except if, mmm, swindler was really, really, really klutzy. And, yeah, she is that, but she's very sweet. I, I mean, the guy, he's very cute, very handsome. I was thinking at first that he was just, like, a bad guy, like, bad boy type. Like, okay, well, you... 
you were falling in love with a good girl. I ain't mad at that. You know, I like when stories do that. Yes, like it's, you know, the bad guy falls for the cute, the adorable <laughs> girl next door type. Like it's cute because she does give me those vibes too. She's really, really adorable. Yeah, and the smart one too as well. But um, I, I feel bad for her because yes, she, like I love the fact that she was able to cite the speech for memory. Memorize that, that ish. But poor baby, after that, she was like, I gotta throw up, I gotta throw up. And she threw up on her homeroom teacher's blouse and the outfit. Oh my god. I cannot imagine how long that took to get it out. I mean, because like the, the blouse was 10,000 yen. And, and I, I don't even remember the price of the other part, but like, still, that's a lot of freaking money. Uh, depending on if you bought that on a sale, and I'm guessing not because 10,000 yen. That's a lot of fucking money when you compare that to American. That has to be like... I'm trying to think. A good like a good blouse on Amazon is like... That I've seen, that I like. 30 to 40, maybe 50 bucks. So I can say maybe around that price point or a little bit more. But woof. Woof woof. <laughs> it's still... Me too, you baby. You, you still had a good first day, but yes, you need sleep. And I hope, you know, her, her eye gave her like an energy drink or something to just bring her spirits up. We all have those moments where like, okay, for example, me. Um, this was, we're in April, so this had to happen between February and March, right? So I went to bed kind of extremely late. I'm I'm a night owl. I, I will literally stay up all night and sleep almost all day. <coughs> Ew, I hate when I do that. Um, and such. Even though I have a job. I will go to bed at like 2 o'clock in the morning and I will wake up at 6. And then I have to get up for work and be ready for work by like 9, 9.30 and out of the house. So that I can be there from 10 to whatever. So, um... <laughs> I, I think one day I got like four or five hours or maybe like six hours of sleep, right? And I was all happy, happy, sunshine, butterfly, um, smiley baby. And inside I felt completely dead. I was like, bro, I want to go home. I want to sleep. And mind you, I had not had nothing to eat. I literally just woke up, got dressed, got ready, got in the car, went to work, did my shift, went home. I think I recorded that day too. And then I went to sleep. So imagine four to five hours of sleep where you feel completely drained and uber sleepy. And you're just like, I want to go to bed. But when you have two jobs and stuff, you got to balance that shit. But I, like I said, this is really cute. First initial thoughts. Very adorable and sweet. I love the colors. The colors are very beautiful and vibrant. A um, little bit of pastel and stuff. It does give me feels to the Sailor Uniform show that I reacted to a couple, couple of months ago and such. Except it, it, it's different. Instead of it being placed in a small town, it's a girl from a small town going into a school that's in the city. So I, I do want to know how she is going to thrive in these new environments. I mean, yes, day one, you got lost, baby. Like I said, when I played Persona 5 the first time, we, I think I can speak for everybody when we played Persona 5 for the first time. We all got lost, even though in the thing, <laughs> it tells us the instructions, right? Like which ones we had, what, 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 <laughs> I can't speak, what train we were on and what train we had to go to next, right? And then next thing you know, you get out and you're like trying to remember, oh my God, which am I supposed to go on? Oh my God, am I supposed to go here? Am I supposed to go there? And then like you finally find it, right? And they're like, oh, due to cleaning, like you can't go this way. And then I'm over here like, well, where am I supposed to go? <laughs> and then eventually I found it. Almost like, what, 30 minutes later? <laughs> But now when I replay the game, I can get it done like five minutes. Five, three, five minutes flat. It does not take me that long. I cannot imagine watching any of my friends playing it and just looking over here like, you got this? Yeah. Yeah, you good. And just be like, oh, they fuck it up. <laughs> but yes, this is really adorable. But go ahead and pause the video and I will see you guys in one second for episode two. All right, episode two in three, two, one, go.
<laughs> you got this, baby. Oh my god, the bags under her eyes. Like, yes, I can do this, even though I am sleepy. Did it break? I think it broke. Kind of. Baby, baby, yes! Pony, pony cheeks! Oh. Oh! I mean, I did think that too. Uh, okay, take two. To me, baby. G right. No. Oh. Well, you know, mm. oh no, we didn't expect this. Come on, Sumi, you got this. That's the greatest. <laughs> If they don't get together. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, he does give puppy dog vibes. He is cute. love the fact that she just shot her hand up quick. Alright, boys. Your turn. Chris is gonna be Shima. <laughs> Feels like to Sasaki Demiano, kind of. Except, you know, it's heterosexual and it's not BL. <laughs> oh, they sure are.
But yeah. The fact, <laughs> Mika, the fact that he is just like anything that she's gonna do, he's gonna do. It's so cute. It's gorgeous. Why do I feel like Mika is just the type of character, and it's only maybe because of the way she is and her aura, the type of character that always wants to start drama and trouble? Me too. Even though I like her. Do you have enough? <laughs> but he's really nice to you because he likes you. Even user sees that. Huh. <sighs> Sue me. It's okay. Got a lot to learn, babe. Yeah, you see how she's already all up on him? Mm mm. Well, babe, remember, small town, you know. But he likes you. <laughs> oh my god, look at her.
There you go. Get that singing voice in. He literally said, read the room. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, because he, he already in love with someone else. <laughs> oh. Oh. My dog. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Perfect. Adorable. Well, you want to be a lawyer, so... Oh, you know. I'm 
química. The shoes I love and I already know it's a guy, mainly due to the fact is the band-aids. <laughs> Yo, what's up? <laughs> yeah, yeah, our, our, our cute, adorable, Plain Jean, baby, Mary Jean. <laughs> Because if you know if Vika ain't get one, she would have been peed. <laughs> oh, they do know each other. <clears throat> Oh, no. I mean, yeah, wouldn't it sing? I get that, but and in some, ugh, I can't speak. In some way, it is important. Usually, sometimes that shows you, like, oh, hey, what are you doing for like the rest of your life?
What? 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 Oh, indeed. Okay. It looks fun. I kind of want one. Where do I need to go? I need to go to Amazon, right? What are they called? I want one. Rolly thingy. <laughs> okay, Shima. So you were, what, a child actor on a show for whatever long, and then you left. And I'm guessing now you just want that normal high school experience and stuff. And I get that. But I still feel like he might still have that celebrity status as with him if it is that way. I'm guessing. Um, but the fact is that only the guy with the glasses who I'm already loving. Um, if he only knows and slowly but surely I feel like he's going to tell people and they're going to find out and then everything's just gonna blow up and just go crazy. Um, Yuzu. Best girl. Sumi and Yuzu are the best girls of this show. I'm sorry. They're both freaking cool, adorable as hell. Yuzu just gives me, she's like the, I think what a lot of people would say, like American beauty and stuff. She is like the, the one who stands out when you're looking at everybody besides Sumi. And I mean, hey, I'm not mad at it. She kind of gives me like on vibes. And then that one other show I reacted to, um, Years ago, I think like two, two or three years ago, I don't remember the name of it. It was about the girls who, um, I think they were all virgins. And, um, they were in a club and they all had, no, one of them got a girl, boyfriend. Mm -hmm. Um, one of them was necessarily a... The S word, because I can't, I, I, I can't, S-L-U-T, there you go, that one was that one, um, and then we had our, you know, our regular mill precious baby girl protagonist, who was just cute as fuck, and she wanted to take the next step with her neighbor, aka her best friend, and she opens the door, and he is over here jerking off. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it makes me want to know a little more about Shima. He seems very interesting. Like he went going into episode one, he was the most mysterious. He still is the most mysterious character now that we know a little more context on him. Um, I'm expecting in the next couple of weeks for his little secret to come out and eventually he's going to have to talk to or about it to Sumi. And I wonder how Sumi is going to react to that and such and then also the adventures that Sumi is going to get into of course this baby is just like I am going to be a lawyer I am going to be this and that the fact that she's also joining student council like I'm not surprised like it was very kind of obvious like I, I couldn't expect her to be in any other club but also just really being like yeah I could be in a club but I also want to be in student council that's kind of what I wanted her to do but it's something just told me I was like I think she's just gonna join student council um Mika I still like you I'm just a little I don't know what to say about you especially after this episode because like I said to me when I look at her she seems like the troublemaking backstabbing bitch only because of what has happened in this episode but hopefully in the next few weeks of the show, she gets to redeem herself and such. I think now that Shima has, you know, hey, could you kind of back off? I think she is officially backing off of him. 
and just knowing that, okay, we're in the friend zone. We're, we're not going to be boyfriend and girlfriend. I'm stuck in the friend zone and I'm never coming out. <laughs> But other than that, guys, that was my reaction to towards episodes one and two of Skip to Loafer. If you lo loaf, loafer, yeah. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos official when I join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially on Tuesday when I come home for work for episode three. Bye, guys.